good things must come to an end. Who will be the final three? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> Pretty nervous about the elimination, um, a bit concerned I'll go, and I definitely want to stay because I want to make the final three. I don't, yeah, I'm just kind of all over the place. I don't really know. Couldn't really sleep last night. This week was about creating mood, emotion and character in front of the camera, as well as presenting yourself to the people who can make or break your career. Today we decide who the final three will be and in turn, who will be leaving these shores to experience the fashion world outside of Australia. Let me remind you of the prizes Australia's Next Top Model will receive. You will feature in your very own eight page fashion spread in Vogue Australia. You'll be represented by Priscilla's modelling agency for 12 months and be sent on an all-expenses-paid trip to New York to meet with an agency there. You will receive a Ford Fiesta XR4 and you will become the face of Napoleon Purtis for 12 months, which includes an international photo shoot. And now to our judges who will help me decide your fate today. Sexy, sassy and smooth-talking Charlotte Dawson. Lord of the Lens, Jez Smith. And ruler of Planet Runway, Alex Perry. Our guest judge is a man who could definitely make or break your career. The publisher of Vogue Australia, Grant Pearce. Today's elimination challenge gives you one more chance to prove that you have actually learnt something this week. We want to see you act out a scenario showing us a range of emotions. And you will be performing with this handsome young man. Ladies, meet James Mitchell. OK, models, this is the scenario. I am your boyfriend. You have just landed a huge campaign with Vogue. So at the start of this scene, you have to be ecstatic. And what's going to happen is, as we're improvising, the judges are going to throw a few different emotions and you have to react to those emotions immediately. OK, let's start with Steph H. Oh, my God, baby, I just got the contract with Vogue. That's amazing, Can really? Can you believe it? What? Tell me, what, what happened? How did, that, how did that come about? My agent just rang me and she was like, oh, my God, you got it. And I was like, ah! Oh, I got, I actually got, oh, my God, I got the campaign for Vogue. I got, I got the campaign. Oh, my God. That's, uh, that's I got the great. campaign. I got it. Oh, my God. And they said, you got it, Alice. And I was like, oh, my God. Alice, Alice, now you have to be doubtful about the whole thing. But the thing is that it means I've got to travel a lot. So I'll oh, be away from home a lot. And really? It just, it makes me worry that I won't be able to spend enough time with, like, you and the dog and mm. all my friends and family. Well, the dog is important, isn't it? Really? Yeah. I, we love the dog. I got it. I got it. Now, Jordan, be doubtful about it. But what if they don't like what I do? And I'm just really scared. Are you going to... You, do you still want to be with me? Why is everything always about you? Why is it always your thing that you have to do? And Why your dreams, what, you know? It's not always about my dreams. This is huge. But I just, I don't want you to be angry with me if I have to go away. And well, I am stuff. angry. I am angry with you. Why? It's just, oh, my God. Wait till my Steph, mum Steph, let's see. About. Hysterical. Hysterical, like upset. Like hysterical. Over the top. Totally hysterical. Okay. I just can't believe Straight it. It's down. so crazy. Just, Can you believe it? Just, it's, it's great. It's great. <laughs> it's, I can't even believe it. It's, it's huge. How huge is it? How huge? <laughs> it's just amazing. Like, I can't believe I got a contract with both. And then, Kurt, let's try Amazed. <sighs> wow. I'm, wow. Actually, I kind of just, um... I'm actually kind of, I'm actually kind of amazed about that. Just like that you're not actually coming over. <sighs> you're, you're amazed about that? You're, you're yeah. pleased that I'm not coming, is that right? Yeah, I kind of, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you're not going to have a boyfriend much longer. <laughs> Jordan, Look, I'm just... you can be bashful. So up myself? Bashful. Like shy. A bit shy, a bit coy. A bit bashful, like, oh, shucks. Babe. 
I'm really scared about all of this, and I, I just need your support. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That was horny. <laughs> I was about to say that. It was. And you'll play catch with him? Yeah, for sure. Even if the ball okay, lands in Alice, the water? frustration. I just... I just worry that if I am away, mm -hmm. that, you know, my, my, my friends and family might not understand why. And I just, it frustrates me that they don't understand how important my career is to me yeah. and how sort of short-term and fleeting it might be. Yeah, right. And it, it just stresses me out. Yeah? Yeah. Well, awesome, Alice. That was unreal. That was great. Thanks, yeah. honey. Yeah. Thank you, James. <laughs> All right, Nicole Kidman, let's look at your photo. <laughs> This photo sort of says to me, oh, that guy was such a dud bash, and the guy knows it. <laughs> uh, and it looks like he knows he was a dud bash as well. So there is, it, it's sort of telling me a story. So no, I kind of like angry. the emotion. Yeah. I'd be angry too. Yeah. <laughs> Alice, I really think it's an amazing picture. You've done a beautiful job. I've got to say, I think this bloody beautiful. It really tells me a story. And I love the sort of fragile, sort of delicate emotion that you've got there. I want to sing, you know, natural woman. You look like a woman for the first time, a sexy, beautiful woman. Certainly your confidence and, and emotion is well and truly being shown there. What do you think? I look a little bit angry almost. No? Yeah, because you were supposed to be content. Yeah. Yeah, I've got to say, Anika, I don't think that you're very successful in projecting that in this photo. Yeah. Anika, I feel like you don't want to be there. Yeah. You, you look awkward and I don't get contentment. Okay. Um, fear, maybe. You were given suspicion and, you know, as far as that goes, I think you nailed it. The only thing that I do think with this is that the position of the face is not particularly flattering for you. I look a bit suspicious because the bloke looks a bit gay. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Jordan. Can you please wait outside while we make our decision? Yeah, thank you.